guys, it's Hannah from Happy Mama Life. Today I am sharing my nighttime routine with you guys and I actually was editing this video and realized that I did not film an intro so I'm already here um, having finished my nighttime routine today in my PJs and makeup off and everything so this is the real deal um, for my nighttime routine. I am so excited to be joining in this collaboration with other moms who are all posting their nighttime routines. It's hosted by Tiffany at Rambling Bumbles and I'll link her below so be sure and go and check out her channel. And there will be a playlist of all the nighttime routines that we're sharing so please be sure and check out all the videos in the playlist. If you're new coming over from the playlist, welcome. I am so happy to have you here on my channel. Be sure and check out some of my other videos so you can see what I look like on a normal basis and not in my pajamas. If you are new, I'm Hannah and I share encouragement and tips and tricks for busy moms. I have four kids under the age of six who always keep me on my toes. So let's jump into our evening and nighttime routine. nighttime routine it's really important for me to try to leave the house pretty neat when we all go to bed so I try to get right to work after dinner. The first thing I do is get all the dishes loaded into the dishwasher. On this particular night we had leftovers for dinner so I didn't have any cooking dishes that had to be loaded so I'm just loading up the plates, cups, all of the dishes that we ate on for dinner. that's done I move to straightening up the kitchen and my kids like to sit at the counter and color and draw and cut teeny tiny pieces of paper so I like to get all of that cleaned up off the counter. Next I move on to wiping down all the counters. I frequently swap up what I'm using for this. Um, this particular time I'm using the Mrs. Myers cleaner and I really like that. I also will wipe off the kitchen table and I use the same cleaner that I use for the counters for this and just a microfiber cloth to clean off the table with. Like I said, on this particular night we had leftovers for dinner so the kitchen is not as messy as it might be on some nights and the kids were pretty good about taking their dishes so um, I just get everything taken off the table and then get it all wiped down. A very important part of my nighttime routine that actually helps me in my morning time routine is going ahead and setting up the coffee to make in the morning. We have a coffee pot that has a timer on it so I go ahead and get the coffee all ready and then set it to come on in the morning before I wake up.
Once our kids are all in bed, I like to go back down to the living room and just straighten up down there. Now this is after the kids have already picked up most of their toys, and we actually keep most of their toys upstairs in their rooms. So this is just a few things that are out, mostly from homeschooling and just from the kids having a few toys they play with. After everything's picked up out of the floor, I go to one of my favorite parts of our nighttime routine and that is turning on our automatic vacuum cleaner. This is really one of the best investments we have made for our home and it will just run and it will vacuum the whole downstairs floor. So that's really most of the work that I have to do for our nighttime routine. Um, so after that, the kids are already in bed, the dishwasher is ready to be run, the vacuum is going. And so at this point in time, I, uh, my husband and I will maybe sit down and watch a movie. I might have some laundry to fold or something like that. But on this particular night, we both um, had some work to do. So we went to our room and both sat with our computers. And then we just kind of chatted while we got some work done. Once I'm ready to start getting ready for bed, I have a very simple um, nighttime skincare routine. I just take off all my makeup. I will wash my face with a um, sort of scrubby face wash and use moisturizer. It's very simple, it's very quick, and just gets me ready for bed. Part of my nighttime routine is to turn on my diffuser and I like to put some lavender in the diffuser which just helps to um, kind of relax me and get us ready to have a great night's sleep. Once that's all set, I am just about ready for bed and what I will do is I will actually turn out all the lights and then I am currently nursing our three month old. So I get him up and I do a little dream feed with him in the dark and put him back to bed and then I crawl into bed and go to sleep myself. I hope you've enjoyed this nighttime routine and I hope that you have a good night.